all right so this is a video for the end time prophetic so we're continuing <coughs> sorry brothers and sisters <coughs> We're continuing until when the most I tells me to stop. So for those of you who are going to jump up and come in the comment section and complain. And, oh, she's talking about vibes, cartel all the time. You don't understand what's going on. And it's to save your soul as well. You may not live in Jamaica. Hallelujah. But I'm telling you, these things that I'm talking about, it is real. Spiritual wickedness in high places, brothers and sisters. So, yes, from the get-go... This video is about Vives Cartel. I've done loads of videos about him. Please check out the playlist. I don't want to go over the videos that I've done. But to do a quick recap, um, you can all sorry, you can also check the um the playlist for it's called Vives Cartel. So you can understand what is going on because some serious spiritual wickedness is happening, especially in Jamaica, in that country. And <laughs> The second exodus is at the door and Satan is pulling out all the stops to, what's the word I'm using, looking for? Dirty, nasty Lucifer is pulling out all the stops so that he thinks that he, he thinks he can stop the great worldwide exodus of the highest people out of Babylon and he's not going to do it. So he's, he's doing everything going through the deception phase, everything for the people. So people have got to ways, wake up and wise up and don't be conformed to this world, right? So I've done a few videos since Vibes Cartel came out of prison. And the first video that I've done, I basically told brothers and sisters, listen, this man is on his last leg. He's basically dying, right? Um, and his wife is a handler. But the Lord also showed me something about the wife as well but i didn't release it because it wasn't time for me to release it so i just released the video saying you know cartel on his last leg and the wife is a handler and i know some of you are coming and say sister karen is not his wife um that's what i saw the word wife on my facebook thing when the feed running through the feed when the feed came up that's what they said wife right um so some people say, no, it's not the wife, it's the girlfriend, it's, you know, fiancé, this, that, what of you. Okay. In the room of the spirit, wife, anyways. Um, but I want to talk a little bit about this woman. I don't know, I don't even know her name. Not really interested, to be fair. Not interested to know this woman's name. But the spiritual annotation surrounding this woman or this wife i'm going to call her wife this wife of vice cartel is um it's not right so not only she's been sent i have to understand what's going on open up your eyes people open up your eyes i did say this woman is a type of delilah not the exact delilah like samson like Samson and Delilah in ancient times. But she's a type of Delilah. Because Delilah suck the strength out of Samson. Set him up nicely. Ha! For the Philistine, isn't it? That's a physical. You have to understand what I'm saying. Please understand what I'm saying. Delilah set up Samson physically for the Philistine to come and harass him. Because we know that nobody could touch Samson because he was so strong. Absolutely strong as a, you know, ox. Supernatural strength. The real, um, authentic Hercules that they have running about in Hollywood, right? Samson was a real deal because his strength was on the most sad. Well, you notice Delilah, what Delilah did, fake false love, isn't it? fake false it sounds real it's a demonic love and when the demonic loves come you have to understand brothers and sisters when you're sent from the enemy just to love somebody demonically if you're not underneath the power of the holy spirit if you're not discerning it works and then you think oh it's real and true and all authentic love obviously with the likes of vice cartel he's in the kingdom of darkness so anything goes for him so he won't be able to decipher 
or discern what is happening. But when the Lord showed me that this wife is a handler and she's been sent, the Lord showed me something else in the realm of the spirit. And as I began to draw this woman up in my spirit to see what is going on, not only with her, but what's going on in the spiritual realm in Jamaica. I saw in the realm of the spirit that this wife is a, she's sort of like mystic Meg. So a witch, basically. That is what I saw. The woman is a witch. You now some of you are watching this and oh, Sister Carrie and this, that. I'm telling you as it is, you got to learn to open up your eyes, brothers and sisters. Not everything that you see in front of you is all, yes, it's in the natural, but you've got to learn, especially those of you who are walking with the most high, you've got to learn to use discernment in these last days. You cannot be on milk all the days of your life. You've got to learn to test the spirits. It is that simple, and we're called to test every single spirit. Baba said, test the spirits, see whether they are of the most high. And I can confirm, and I can tell you, I can confirm, and I can tell you that this so-called wife is not sent by the most high. She's from the kingdom of darkness. To finish off, Vice Carter. Now, let me quickly say this, because some of you in the comment section are saying, oh, Sister Karen, Sister Karen, you know, cartel is a clone. It's, it's not a clone. That's the real cartel that came out of prison. I've done, that's why you have to watch a playlist, because I really, I don't really want to go over the playlist. I mean, the videos that I've done. So it's very important that you watch a playlist, Vibes Cartel, to so understand what I'm saying. Some of people said, oh, that's not cartel, you know, cartel don't look like that, this, that. He's sick, he's dying. And obviously, I said it in the video that he's on high-dose steroid. When you're on high-dose steroid and your organs are failing, brothers and sisters, I'm telling you, you're going to swell up like a balloon. Your face is going to swell, and, if, and especially if your liver is failing, you're going to have something called ascites, where around your abdominal looks like you're pregnant. You just round like a barrel. Because there's loads of failure, failure here, failure, kidney, this, that. And that's because of a rare cancer that's going on inside of him. And I said it in the video, he can be healed. Because though he is part of the kingdom of darkness, a very high one. Not just a little baby. Not, vice cartel is not just, you know, take his little pinky finger and just mm, taste the darkness. No, he's, he's all, he's... Is consumed, but being consumed is still, for some reason, high is merciful. He's still got that godly conscious that's going on. He's still got it because he's not cloned. Once he's cloned, that's going to go, unfortunately. Can't really repent, to be fair, because that's the entity that's going to take over him is going to be really, really wicked. But, um, He's not a clone now. He's not. That's the real cartel. But I said it in the video, you need to watch it. Should he go abroad for so called treatment? It's not treatment. They will clone him. There's no Jamaica don't have the facility to, to do it. They don't have it. Because this thing is a high ranking demonic. I don't even know what, what to call it, lab stuff, some stuff that they do to do this cloning business. Because fallen angels, fallen angels have to take over the body. And you he, he have to be at a specific location. You can't just do it any and everywhere. And Jamaica don't have that facility. I'm telling you, they don't. They may do in the future because Jamaica is, unfortunately, it's a little Babylon. Because they're following the ways of Babylon, U.S., so I, I call Jamaica Little Babylon for now, right? But they don't have the cloning facilities out there. They don't. They don't. I'm telling you, brothers and sisters. So he's not a clone. Yes, he's wicked, you know, and of the kingdom of darkness. But that's the real cartel. It is. It's a real one. Um, the wife is a witch. 
a type of mystic meg so sort of like or can I put it? There's different level of witchery, isn't it? There's different level of witchery. <laughs> the, everything that I'm telling you is what the Holy Ghost is revealing to me. I don't know her. I don't even know her name. Don't know nothing. But when you are, when you're connected to the spirit of a higher, it shows you truth. And you might say, oh, what does that have to do with the church? It has a lot to do with the church. Because a lot of Christians sing wicked music. A lot of them glorify these pop artists. That is not of the most that out there. And you have a generation that is coming up. And if you don't expose the works of darkness, these generations are going to be lost. And then what are you going to say to the most? Uh, well, I didn't talk about it because I'm, I was scared people are saying that I'm talking too much about celebrities. No, people want to say that they say that, but they're not going to stop the word from going out. Now, this is to save people and to understand the spiritual works of darkness. There are people that walk amongst us that are not human beings. They're not. They look human. They act human. But they're physically not human beings. They're not. So, when the most I uh, begin to draw this wife, woman business up, in my spirit i heard mystic meg now over here in babylon uk um years ago i don't even know if she's alive i have no idea but um when i was wicked i say when i was wicked right um and i used to buy the newspaper this was years and years ago it was about 2003 2004 2000 there was a woman over here always featured in the newspaper called mystic meg <laughs> mystic meg I don't know if she's still alive, this woman. Always featured in the paper. But that's a type of, this is a type of wife, Mystic Meg. A type of a medium, medium type. But she's a witch. Yeah, absolutely. I'm telling you. Ahaya cannot lie. Ahaya never lie. No, you have good, not me said it, but some people said, oh, you have good witches. And you have bad witches. A witch is a witch. There is no good witch. There is no bad witch. Because you are getting your power from a different source. Not from the most style. So if you are getting your power. Or whatever you are doing from a different source. Or, or your influence from a different source. Then... That information is of a familiar spirit. It's of a lying spirit, though it may sound true. But that's that's the word that the most I gave me concerning this woman. She's a type of mystic mystic med business, a witch. But the Lord gave me the information when he showed me the word handler. But I just didn't want to release it because it would have been too much for the video. So I'll just use Handler. She's been sent. The, the, the kingdom of darkness sent her to finish him off. Because they know because they know that he's not fully. Yes, he's part of the kingdom of darkness, but he's still got that godly conscious going on. They know it. They know. They absolutely know. They know. Vives Carter still got the godly conscious going on and that's what they want to kill so this woman is sent to stop the spiritual elevation but a lot of people are praying for vives cartel because his influence he's he's a type of beyonce he's a type of jamaican beyonce really and truly in terms of you know the level of authority that he has in the kingdom of darkness is quite high and the lukewarm Christians cannot pray for him. I'm sorry. If you're lukewarm, you're not living holy, you're not living right, please do not pray for Vives Cartel because them demons are going to come after you. It takes some high level spiritual prayer warrior who understand how to get into the kingdom of darkness to pull his soul out. But if you're lukewarm, don't even try and attempt praying for him. Don't do it. I'm telling you. 
Bible cannot lie. Ahaya cannot lie. There's a scripture in the Bible that talks about the seven sons of Sepha. It's in the book of Acts. The seven sons of Sepha. And they were trying to imitate Paul. Because Paul had the authority of the Holy Ghost inside of him. So he could command, declare and decree, hallelujah, in the realm of the spirit, things that he wants to make manifest in the natural. He could do the deliverance of devils. And seven sons of Caesar, well, obviously they wanted the lion, right? Because Paul was using the name of Yesiah. And the name of Yesiah was working, but Paul was connected to Yesiah. Hallelujah. Paul is part of the kingdom of heaven. And these seven sons of Sepha saw what was going on with Paul. And they think, you know what? We want to cut false prophets, isn't it? So there was this guy. Go and read it. It's in the book of Acts. There was this guy that was possessed with demons. Seven sons of Sepha, 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 thought that, hey, we can use the name of Jesus. We call him Messiah. We can use a name and cast out this devil out of the sky because Paul is doing it. <laughs> so we can. Hallelujah. And brothers and sisters, the seven sons of Sepha, um, the seven, I'm trying to find it. I think it's in Acts, Acts 2. Um, <clears throat> the seven sons of Sepha tried to sort of, they were doing exorcism. I can't pronounce the word. Exorcism. <laughs> we're trying to cast out <laughs> the demon out of this man. And what actually happened to them is that the demons turned on them and started to beat them up. Strip them naked, punch, beat, everything. The demon spoke and said, Paul, I know. Yesiah, I know. But who are you? And this is the reason why I'm saying not every, and every, not every and anybody can pray for cartel. They can't do it. And this is a warning. When we're jumping on your knees and, you know, you have to have the power. You have to be given authority to pray for, for people like that. Because if not, you're going to be in serious spiritual trouble. There's no if, buts, or maybe. You're going to be in serious, serious spiritual trouble. And I think it's found that the seven sons of Sefa, Sefa, S-C-E-V-A, Sefa, Sefa, However you pronounce it, it's in the book of Acts 19, verses 11 to 20. Let me quickly read. So it's in the book of Acts. Listen to this. This is in the book of Acts, chapter 19, verse 11 to 20. Um, we talk, the Bible talks about, like I said, Paul doing many, many miracles. And... Verse 16 says, and the man in whom was the evil spirit leaped on them. The seven sons of Sepha leaped on them, mastered all of them, and overpowered them. So they fled out of the house naked. So the demon tear off the clothes of these men and wounded them. And this became known to all the resident, residents of Ephesus, both Jews and Greeks, and fear fell upon them all. And the name of the Lord was extolled. Also many of, the, of those who were not believers came confessing. You see, the thing about it is that when, when deliverance happened, there should be a level of people giving their hearts to the most high. But in these day and age, when people do deliverance, so-called deliverance, it's the pastor, it's the prophets that get the glory, not Yesiah. It's all wonderful is that prophet or prophetess. Oh, they're mighty and this and that. Yes, you can acknowledge them. There's nothing wrong. 
Yet there's absolutely nothing wrong with acknowledging a prophet or a prophetess. No, you can't. You can say, oh, you know, you are sent by the most I give a higher thanks for you. We glorify your life and stuff like that. But at the same time, the glory and the exaltation has to be given to the most higher. But the woman that he's married to is a witch, a type of mystic business. Ahaya cannot lie. Ahaya never lies. And you know what I, I, I praise the Lord for? Or why I'm doing these videos? Because I want to wake up Jamaica. It is time. We talk about my videos, ain't it? I talk about the videos that I do. Just reaching a, a, a certain portion. Not well, even a certain portion. Reaching, you know, few. <laughs> few in Jamaica. Because the enemy knows if my channel, if this channel should ever... I don't even know though. if this channel should ever do well in it's not doing well over there at the moment but if this channel should ever do well in jamaica in the caribbean in africa it's trouble satan knows it's going to be threatened because i'm coming with truth to wake up the people But we continue to pray and ask the most high to open up the, the airwaves and the stagnation on this channel because it's all a demonic attack. But it's okay. Aya is going to work it out. But yes, brothers and sisters, I wanted to come and um, and thank you to those brothers and sisters. I don't want to sound ungrateful, but thank you to those brothers and sisters who have commented on the, underneath the videos. I am from Jamaica because I did say that in the last video. If you're from Jamaica, the island, and you live, you live in JA, please just say you're from JA watching the video. And I see it, and I see the handful of brothers and sisters. I appreciate you. I thank you very, very, very much. But I want you to know that the bulk of my viewership is from babylon us it really is and i give a higher glory honor and praise for that i thank the most i really and truly for my beautiful brothers and sisters over there in babylon us but yes brothers and sisters i feel led to come and i have to do this video i have to release this video so that you know what's going on the woman the wife you know i don't know her name please if you know her name put it in the comment section you know when i was preparing to do this video the lord began to speak to my spirit and i heard 13 um bloodline of satan I think that some people just believe that, you know, that is it. Yesiah, every single human being that is on this earth belongs to the most. Uh, every, no, it's not true. <laughs> Satan has got an offspring. What the Bible says when Adam and Eve, when Adam and Eve sinned in the garden and were cursing the serpent. Sure what? bruise is healed and the woman offspring shall fight against the offspring of satan so we already know from the word get go that satan has a nation on this earth that's why to be very careful who you marry some people are sent to destroy your destiny to finish you off talk about i did some videos talking about counterfeit husbands and counterfeit wives and these people tear you down and do not elevate you you have to be very careful brothers and sisters but i want you to know i want you to know that satan has a bloodline he's got 13 bloodline why the number 13 because he mimics yesiah yesiah has 12 disciples plus yesiah walking around me 13 men hallelujah and so Satan has 12 bloodlines, plus him, the dirty devil, 13. I'm telling you, it's mimics. He's a wicked serpent. He's a wicked fallen angel. And he comes to kill, steal, and destroy. And if you're not spiritually alert, if, you're, um, if your vibration is very low, if you've got low vibration and low energy, you're not going to pick up on these spiritual things. You only can attain 
the vibration and the energy through the Holy Spirit. That's it. Nothing else. No yoga, no meditation, no this, no that. You only can obtain this level of alertness through the power of the Holy Spirit so that you will not be deceived. And people might come and say, oh, you know, what, you know what's the beef between you and Carter? Well, I don't know her. I've not, put her name in the comment section because I have, I have no idea what she's called. None whatsoever. But I heard in my spirit the 13 bloodline of Satan. It's to do with the names as well. I don't I know some of the names like the Windsor, Rockefeller, um couple more of loads of ten more of them. Windsor, Rockefeller, um some more. <laughs> some more there. Yeah. But you have to be on the alert. Don't be deceived. Do not be deceived, all right? So I want to come and do this video. So be bold, be strong, be courageous, walk with Aya, just like Enoch of the mindset of Job. All oh, praises, all oh, beautiful praises to the most high Aya, who lives above the heavens. Aya, eternally bless you. I love you all, and I will see you soon. Something in glory in your size, holy name, amen. Amen. Benjamin, Jude chapter 1, verses 24 to 25. The Bible reads, Now unto him that is able to keep you from falling and to present you forth less before the presence of his glory with exceeding joy. Joy. To the only wise Messiah, our Savior, be glory and majesty, dominion and power, both now and ever. Amen and amen. Amen. Blessings.